Punjabi is one of four languages used in the lyrics of Bangra Symphonica's music. On this stage, three stars collide, rock, classical and Bangra. The components are from renowned musical groups in their own genres, Kismet Bangra Band and Classical Orchestra Le Swan. From our first rehearsal, we knew that we had something completely special on our hands and it was up to us to make the most of what we had. And I think this combination working tonight is going to be an incredible, an incredible sound. This new group has grown through innovation since that very first acoustic jam session when Ron met David. The violinist expects there will be more audience participation on the dance floor than he's accustomed to seeing at classical concerts. Classical audiences are traditionally very reticent and they tend to sit and concentrate but this is all about being part of a whole event and uh, I've seen Kismet performances where they get up on stage and you know the audience is there with the band and everything. The venue for tonight's performance, Draper's Hall, is almost 200 years old and while the architecture speaks of classical regency, the music is a very modern fusion inspired by the Singh Brothers' childhood growing up in multicultural Britain. Let's do with people what we can do with music. What we want is to encourage people to come with open ears, open eyes, open minds and most importantly open hearts. You know, don't look at the colours on stage, listen to the music, let you, let you be taken in by the music and enjoy the journey. Bangor Symphonica will perform at the historic Ragley Hall near Ulster on the 9th of August, where the musical fusion will resound across the Warwickshire countryside. Emma Thomas, BBC Midlands Today, Coventry.